In tonight's Consumer Alert, the phrase shop till you drop was taking on a whole new meaning. A new survey finds millions of Americans are shopping while drinking. As reporter Meg Oliver tells us, it's leading to some interesting decisions. Have a couple of drinks and then hop on the internet. What could possibly go wrong? It seemed like a good idea at the time, I guess. Nick Stuckey admits he was tipsy when he bought these googly eyes for his car, posting on Reddit, the best drunk online purchase I have made yet. It's one of those things where like it comes in the mail and you're like, I don't quite remember what I ordered. And uh, yeah, then you kind of, it hits you and everything. In a new survey from finder.com, 68 million people admit it to drunk shopping, racking up about $447 per person, double the amount from the previous year. We do spend a lot of money um, while we're drunk. Um, the problem is actually totaling over $30 billion. $30 billion. $30 billion. So and spontaneous purchases. Exactly. Food is the top purchase, followed by shoes and clothes. But social media is filled with questionable drinking decisions, like this person who accidentally bought 100 top hats for her pet toad. Ian Stratford admits being under the influence when he bought a t-shirt of a sloth. And this man proudly posted the hot pink outfit he ordered after a few rounds. It's easier to buy after you've had a few drinks? Yeah, yeah, definitely. The study found men like Adam Laino are more likely than women to do it. You're in a good mood and you just, you seem like, it may seem like you need this at the moment and then you're like, oh, next day you're like, I really don't really need it. Making those heated s'more slippers and inflatable adult T-Rex costume part of an expensive hangover. Meg Oliver, CBS News, New York. The survey found millennials are the most likely to shop while under the influence. Shocking. Yeah, set oh. it and forget it. <laughs> Shocking. Yeah. yeah, well, some football teams doing some shopping uh, this week as they gear up for the next season that starts tomorrow at 3 p.m. We've got some of these details coming up next.